You guys, I'm gonna drive slowly through here. I'm gonna show you something that I really appreciate. This is where I usually go out walking. I do this late at night. Sometimes I do this mid-afternoon like I did today. It's just so nice, isn't it? Like this is some like classic American pastime shit right here, you know? Like when I think of America, like when I, th when I have a nice little mental picture of America, th this is it. So it's not all bad. And there's some pretty nice people where I live. Shit, is that a cop? Nope, it's not a cop, calm down. <laughs> there's like no crime in this town. Of course, we don't know how long that's gonna last. It's pretty good here though, man. There's not really that much crime in Nashville either. I mean, I guess it just depends on what part you're in. But, So like I do comedy in North Nashville and it doesn't make me nervous at all. If the comedy in East Nashville it doesn't make me nervous. Maybe there's something wrong with me. Maybe I'm just like naturally a crazy person, so it's like that kind of shit doesn't scare me, but I think it's more wrong place, wrong time. Rather than like, okay, it's always bad in this neighborhood or it's always bad with this group of people or whatever. It's like you just never know what's gonna happen. Somebody might snap, somebody might go off. I can usually predict that sort of thing too. Like I can tell when people are gonna freak the fuck out. Nobody's pulled a gun. I mean, that hasn't happened in front of me, but I can always tell when somebody's about to have a panic attack or somebody's about to flip their shit. I've seen it happen so many times in the restaurant industry. I remember one time I was like eating at Waffle House and like the grill cook just like had a straight up panic attack. <laughs> and I was like waiting on it. Like I could tell that he was about to lose his shit and then he did. But uh, just to give you an update, that couple that I was filming that was fighting, they're still together.